What if Bitcoin is the titanic of cryptocurrencies? Because at its core, it's just a math problem. We're always told that Bitcoin is unhackable. And in today's world, with today's technology, that's true. But it won't be true forever. And that's got people worried. The next phase of computing, being built in labs by Google, IBM, Microsoft, and many others, could shatter that security in hours, not millennia. I'm talking about quantum computers. And in due course, they will change everything about cryptocurrency security. Bitcoin uses something called ECDSA encryption on the SECP 256K1 curve. The math is so hard that even the world's most powerful supercomputers would need millions of years to crack it. But here is where quantum computers change the game entirely. In 1994, mathematician Peter Shaw developed an algorithm that could use quantum computers to break the exact type of encryption Bitcoin uses. Able to solve in hours what would take today's computers millennia. If you could solve the discrete log problem, you could break the crypto systems. But a reality check, we're not there yet. Today's most advanced quantum computers, like Google's Willow, are impressive, but they're nowhere near powerful enough. And when I say impressive, I mean nothing less than wow. A calculation that takes Willow under five minutes would take the fastest supercomputer 10 to the 25 years, or a time scale way longer than the age of the universe. Even so, fastest quantum computers from Microsoft and Google currently have thousands of qubits, not millions. To actually break Bitcoin's encryption, you'd need around 13 million physical qubits. So when should we actually worry? Here's what the experts are saying. By 2028, 2031, the US government predicts quantum computers will have the potential to pose some risk to current levels of security encryption. Progress is slow though, because quantum computers are at the absolute leading edge of the world's technical capacity and must operate in physical environments that don't actually exist in nature. The colder you get, we start at room temperature, 50 Kelvin, 10 Kelvin, 3 Kelvin, which is outer space now for a reference, 0 0.01 Kelvin. And this here is where we actually mount the quantum processor. Literally the coldest places in the universe. The US government isn't planning full migration to quantum safe systems until 2035. The US National Institute of Standards Technology has already finalized new post-quantum cryptography standards. Here, recorded in 2021, Security Chief Matthew Scholl gives the Institute's take on the matter. Once practical quantum computers becomes available, all current public key algorithms will be vulnerable. Relax. We know. Are you reassured? It's no time to panic. So this isn't a crisis happening tomorrow, but it's also not science fiction. And the timeline for quantum resistant Bitcoin is slightly shorter than many people realize. The question isn't if quantum computers will threaten Bitcoin's current security, it's actually when, and whether the crypto ecosystem will be ready when it does.